December. Wednesday is December 13th. Going to uh, finish up a leaf job at Ray Meow last Friday. So we're going to go down there and do that. I'll do a little round, talk around about it. I ain't got a whole lot of power on my damn camera because I forgot to plug it in. So we'll just do it before and after. A little talk. Maybe an in-between. So I got to drive down there. I got to air up my tire. I always check my air and my tires. And, and uh, usually I have to air up a few little the front tires on my mowers and stuff. Check them all out. Make sure they're aired up good and ready to go. Then I gotta run to the gas station and get a little gas for my two cycle, my blowers. And I'll stick a little gas in the truck, probably a little extra in the jug just in case I need it. But I don't think I'll need any more. I filled my mowers up out of my jug a while ago. <clears throat> so, uh, yeah. I'm gonna, next time, I, well, I'll see you at the job site. Yeah. Finally made it to my job. You can see where I went down through there the other day on that road down there behind me. This right here we don't do. This grows up in a bunch of brush. It usually stays there pretty good. You can it didn't it's looking pretty good actually. I did this the other day. This driveway was covered like this. I gotta go up there and do a little bit, a little field up there about a uh, half acre or something. I'll get my uh, I haven't started these lawnmowers this morning so let me start this one here up. Let her warm up a little bit. We're going to take it first and drive around. 375 hours. a quick look here what we got to do I guess I didn't want to but I will these, these leaves right here blow them over that way a little we might go down through there one more time not too bad really I'm about almost done with it I got a little bit to do in here all these leaves here I chopped up the other day but I may run over them one more time so it all dries out this is more or less done I may go over it once and then I got to get back in there with my blower and blow a bunch of that stuff back out, out of here this hair I'm gonna go through and uh, blow on it and inside that by that horse barn there's a I'm gonna do a little bit in there too but yeah and this right here we got quite a bit to do but that's just a little bit of before it really don't look that much better when I get done because there ain't any grass so we're gonna blow all these out of here too. So let's see what we can do real quick. And I'll uh, get back with you guys later. I'm just gonna get her done because I wanna get done. I'll uh, talk to you after I get done. Oh man. I'm finally done. I don't even wanna see what time it is. I'm gonna look. But it's way past quitting time. Oh yeah, I put in way too much time. All right, I'm getting the hell out of here. This one took forever, but I finally got it looking pretty decent. I think. I think I do. I think I do, boys. I didn't. I just got done blowing off his back deck and blew his leaves into the woods. There's just so much down here. You're not gonna get it perfect. And over here in the center part, there ain't any grass. It's got so many damn trees, there ain't no grass growing hardly. It needs to cut down some of them trees. I wouldn't have hardly any of them. Woo, baby. Back to my truck driving hat. I'm 
gonna go home, take a shower, call it a day. I need to call a customer. I think I got one more leaf job to do. I'm mean, not sure though. I'll show you what I've done. This little road going back down in there. This is actually done. I hauled about six loads of leaves off of this. This is just nutshells and small remnants of uh, leaves. A few around the trees there. The front yard looks pretty decent. show you his car the backs back there it's paying the ace there ain't much back there though this little horse lot done it but man I sure would like to own this place except when I was uh I'll show you another spot I did here when I was mowing this up here in these trees there's a little half acre or something up there maybe a quarter of an acre go up that gate there and there's a little grass patch on the other side of them trees but I was mowing it and I seen man that guy there's a like a Toyota 4Runner or Nissan Pathfinder one or the other he come flying down this dirt road and he sat right here and did about four donuts just ripping it now he was just ripping some donuts right there see his marks Then he almost lost it, I think, and he almost hit those mailboxes. I was hoping like hell he'd fall in that big ditch right there and then I could say, you know, give a good laugh at him. I did this little patch of grass too. When you get right here, you'll be able to see where I uh, did that little patch right up there. It's the easements, what it is for the telephone, for the electricity. I was growing up real bad one time and I took a track, my uh, brush hog and mowed it all down with that little tractor. I was mowing over two, three inch thick trees. Anyway, I'm out in the country, headed back toward the homestead. I gotta call the wife as she called me. Looks like. worried about me where are you <laughs> man this year this week's a nice whoa you guys are about to fall off there boys girls it's been a nice week i don't know what i'm looking like i look like hell all that leaf dust not as dusty as it usually is because uh we just had some rain that's why i got rained out friday on this one and then i uh I forgot. I forgot what I was saying. Oh, I got rained out, and then I had been letting it dry a couple of days here, so I could come down and get it. But it was just right, actually. A little bit of moisture, and then cut down on some of the dust. I think I still had some dust. But yeah, okay. I ain't got a whole lot to say. We're only about two weeks out from Christmas. Uh, I'll be glad December's over in January I'll be sitting in my office doing uh, paperwork all month I got a couple jobs I'm gonna try to get done I think I got one more leaf job then I got a tree job I picked up the other day I may have another leaf job too I don't know Okay, I'm gonna get off here. And uh, anything exciting happens today, I'll grab my camera and let you guys know about it. Then I'll put this on tonight. I forgot the film. Dang it! I was playing around in my bucket truck again. Cut a few more limbs off that tree. This one. I'm getting further away from my shop. But I can't get in there because I got all this crap in my way. This is all going to get cleaned up. It's my prog, prog, 
my shop improvements in progress. Right here, my shop's about almost two foot shorter, lower over here than where that truck is. From this corner to where that truck right there is almost two foot probably at least. I need to dig all that out. There's a lot of dirt right in there. That truck, yeah, it's just stupid. I'm gonna dig this out, all this topsoil, and make me a berm back there for my fence to go on on the back side of my property. So, I've got to get it high up so it's like the railroad was. I don't know if I got that much, but yeah. There's a lot of dirt here, I know that much. Anybody need some blocks in town for anything? I got probably a couple hundred of them there almost. Maybe 150. Dollar piece. No, no extra for the red ones. Alright, I ain't saying nothing, ain't doing nothing. I got that big leaf job done, you guys seen that? I didn't show you me doing it. Tomorrow I'll show me working on one. I got my one over by P Hill I gotta go do. So, we'll hit another one tomorrow. Pretty good size, too. Let's talk to y'all later. I don't even know what I look like here. I'm looking at my back of my, my thing here. I even ran my chipper a while ago. I ran my chipper, cut a few limbs off that tree. That big tree, that big limb right there. That big one right there going up, it went all the way over my shop, over the top of my shop. And I cut her back. Slowly but surely I'll get that tree cut down. I'm just working on a little bit after I get done doing my other jobs. Maybe I'll get it down this week. Then I'll show you how I uh, kill the stump. I'm going to show you guys how I'm going to kill that stump. This fence is coming down. It's a big mess, ain't it? What a mess. What a mess. I got some good stuff in here. I got a couple snow plows in here. And a skid steer bucket for a small one. 54 inch. 54, something like that I think it is. And there's a ripper that goes on the back of a skid steer back there. Yeah. Good stuff there, Van. There's another snow plow that goes on a riding lawnmower. That's an international Cope Cadet snow plow there. It used to be cream colored. I'm thinking about putting on that old uh, black riding lawnmower that I got. Or one of my zero turns. That'd be good on the Husqvarna, wouldn't it? No. Actually, I could put it on the front of this. That'd be pretty sweet. Okay. Lord loves working, man. This is all I got for this one. Thanks for watching. See you on the next one. If you're watching this, where you're at now is I've already ended my video, but I have to. I got that job tomorrow. I got to go to, and I got to fix this freaking flat tire real quick. see me use my Harbor Freight tire machine that had a new tire on it. I got one in the garage. All the other three are new. This is just the one I didn't change. I had four of them. There we go. Now we're there. Let me get my tools out.
where's the four way? Okay, now we gotta go to the tire machine. Which is uh, through that door. I lied. I didn't paint it up. I just paint it. I'm just painting over all the rust. I used black, but I run out. Now I got some uh, rust oleum primer for rusty metal. We'll go over the whole damn thing with this. It's a new can, so I know how to make it. Should I uh, put my wheel on there while it's wet? I think I will put my tire on there while it's wet, but I'm gonna put some grease on my rubber uh, bead. <clears throat> we'll uh, put it on there while it's wet, but we're gonna be we're gonna make sure we got a good bunch of grease on there so it don't stick to this tire. Good Lord. You guys can't even see what I'm doing. Uh, got me some grease. I'm gonna grease the bead so it don't stick to that damn wet paint. Yeah, get her all good and lubed up. Let me flip it over and get inside.
They were sure they don't want it, the tire painted on. Probably ain't even seeing what I'm doing. There he was. That's good enough. I lied. I'm out here still. I thought you wasn't going to, but I'm going to finish it tonight. So I'll just... We can check it in the morning and see if it's still holding air. got let's see how much air is in it i think i got it too i put too much air in the damn thing i'll let them out we'll let a little out now we'll check it all right let's go in there and see how much is our gauge says i need a new gauge that's about i don't know if you guys are focusing in on that or not I think it's about 38 maybe okay it's a little over 35 we're gonna leave it there we'll check it in the morning we'll just leave our gauge right here where it's out and then we'll uh push it back get it in the morning and check it again and then we'll put it on the trailer and go do our work all right lord loves working man yeah that's what happens i don't know what i'm doing I'm trying to do the old uh, ky 102 uh thing frankie her mouth moving we mow yachts. Lord loves a working man. Talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Have a good night. This camera sucks. It's too bright.